Hello everyone, it's Van Berman here. I uh, just want to start the video by saying I'm not feeling terribly brilliant 100% at the minute. There's a lot of cold going around and now I seem to have caught it. Um, Danny, if you're watching this off uh, Gator Legend Continues, I know how you feel. Uh, you look pretty rough in that video as well, by the way. So, yeah, I'm sort of going on that theme, I guess. Um, anyway, I did want to do a video. I wanted to do a video a couple of days ago, but... Um, I was starting to feel it then, and actually I feel worse now, but, um, you know, quite a lot of painkillers later, and it's not quite as bad. The thing I want to talk about is, obviously, Final Fantasy IX is going to be coming out, as you all know, um, and Steam are advertising, or it's been advertised on Steam, is coming out in early 2016, so that means, you know, really, we should be getting any time for the next couple of months, which is really great. Um, I'm looking forward to playing it again, I will be getting it. And uh, probably do a playthrough or something on it as well. Uh, I'm not going to commit to that at the minute because obviously I have a lot of stuff going on. But um, the thing I really want to talk about in this video is... And I know this isn't a new thing because I think... What did they? I can't remember which other game they released it for. But they've been releasing these extra things, you know, with on the different Final Fantasies they've re-released. But the thing I don't like is the um, the game boosters. So obviously we had the game boosters in Final Fantasy VIII and Final Fantasy VII. Uh, in VIII, what did they do? You could have magic. You could have some sort of magic thing where they stocked up your magic, or just your low-level magic anyway. Final Fantasy VII had... Um, oh, I can't remember now. They might have had no encounters as well. I can't remember. But that's the thing I really have a problem with. I don't have a problem with the high-speed thing. I mean, I, wouldn't want to, I don't want, particularly want to play the game like that, but... You know, if you want to speed up the encounters and the battles to make them seem a bit more um, real-time, because the ATB system in Final Fantasy IX is a bit more real-time than in Seven VII and Eight, because um, it's active, obviously. But the having the no-encounter mode is, well, I don't know, it's a bit rubbish. I mean, in Final Fantasy VIII, it sort of makes sense. You know, you can complete that. I have once completed that game being level 15. You know, uh, you get Diablos as early as you can, you, t you make sure there's no encounters, and then you only have the encounters when they have to come up. And when, obviously, you fight the bosses, you don't gain any experience from it. So, you know, that did it in a different way. But with Final Fantasy IX, encounters are actually important, you need to level up. You will need to grind at some point uh, in order to be able to beat bosses and such, and even if you've got your strategy nailed down. So, yeah, I'm not really massively impressed with that, I don't like it, I mean don't get me wrong it's an extra option that's in there but I'm looking at it from a very nos nostalgic point of view I've got my rose tinted glasses on and I'm just thinking about how much I enjoyed it and the way it was previously and I suppose with the whole Final Fantasy 7, you know, remake thing coming out, that sort of adds to that feeling as well um, but yeah anyway, let me know what you guys think below you think it's a good idea, a bad idea um I don't mind that it's... Well, I don't mind that some of the stuff's in there, but the no encounter mode in Final Fantasy IX is a little bit ludicrous, I think, personally. But, you know, people want to do speedruns and that sort of thing, and obviously this will help with that. But that's a, see, that's a very, very specific usage. I mean, you know, you could always mod the game in a certain way to do that. You don't need an official, officially supported way of doing it. Anyway, my voice is starting to go now, because I can feel it hurting my throat hurting even so um i'll leave it there thank you much for watching if you've got any thoughts or opinions on it please put them in the comments below and um yeah it'd be great to hear what you guys think about it um but i'm looking forward to it coming out don't get me wrong anyway guys see you very soon